Hey, what's up, guys? It's Rectified here, and in today's episode, we'll be playing some more Red Dead Redemption. And what we'll be doing is we'll be doing another Irish mission. And sorry for the voice quality in the last video, guys. I mean, you could hardly hear me. But um, I think I've sorted this sorted it out in this video. So um, yeah, we're gonna make it over to the Irish mission. And um, yeah, I'll see you when we make it there. Okay guys, so we're at Benedict's Point, which is where we will be um, doing the Irish mission. So we're just going to go down there right now. Um, okay, so we might have to go an alternative route. So I'm just going to go this route, it'll be a lot more easier. So here we are, now we're just going to start the um, Irish mission. So here we are. Uh, a mighty fine corset you got here, young lady. I got you. Let hungry Irish honey. Where are you? Oh, what? Who do you want? I, I see you. Get away from me. Right here. Where's that machine gun, Irish? Oh, Mr. Marston. I, I found you one. Found us one, Irish. We're in this together. You, me, and an assault on Fort Mercer. I'm the guy that saved you from getting killed back there. And who you owe your life to, remember? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Happens to me all the time. <laughs> you don't want it to happen to you again, do you, Irish? Uh, no, friend. I want to buy you a drink. I want to tell you how much she means to me, how special she is. And I want to tell you that if you don't produce a Gatling gun within the hour, you'll wish you'd been killed back there. <laughs> it's the whiskey, sir. Uh, it gives me the memory of a newborn babe. As innocent as can be. Uh. And it makes me violently angry. Shall we go look for that gun, sir? <laughs> yes. Let's do that. Uh. Okay, guys, so we're gonna go look for a Gatling gun. Um... So I'm just going to get on my horse and follow Irish. So this is needed for the assault on Fort Mercer. Because in the last video he um, lied to us about it. So now he's actually going to get us one. somewhere between dying and dead if you try to cross me again. It weren't like that at all, feller. My intentions were pure. I swear it on me poor mother's life. I just get a tad confused from time to time. Honest mistake. If there's any more confusion, I'll finish what your friends in Armadillo start. Jesus, you're an impatient bastard, aren't you? Where's the gun, Irish? I hear some miners been blabbing about a machine gun they found. Apparently, they got it stashed up at Gap Tooth Breach. What do miners want with a machine gun? Shooting at somebody, I suppose? Or sell it? I don't know. I've never been down a mine in all my life. Sounds real fishy to me, Irish. I've just about had it with you and your game. You and Wes Dickens are so crooked, you can swallow nails and spit out corkscrews. Maybe if you was more cordial with folks, they might be better inclined to help you. I saved your life, and you repaid me by lying, nearly getting me killed. Not fair now, Johnny. We should go around the side of Gap Tooth so the miners don't see us coming. I still don't know what miners would want with a machine gun. Miners are always fighty bastards. Spend too long without daylight and boxes, and it starts playing with your mind. I never heard so much shit come out of one mouth. Only telling you what I heard. Oh, and we'll need a wagon or something to get it out of there. That gun's heavier than sin. So how was I supposed to move it by myself last time? Two-faced little bastard. 
Here we are. Let's stop here a moment to get a lie of the land. The entrance is plain to see, and there's a shaft them bastards used to haul out heavy ore. We, I mean you, can use that lift to get you and the gun to the surface. I do it all myself, but the mines play havoc with me sinuses. I'll find us a fine place to hide these horses, and then return with a borrowed flat wagon. I'll meet you at the mouth of the mine shaft, and Irish, I strongly advise you don't run off this time. You're trespassing. State your business or move along. Okay, so we're gonna go raid this mine and get the Gatling gun. Open fire! So yeah, we just killed the two um, pink patrol guards, and I'm just gonna loot both their corpses. We need to find a way into the mine. We're gonna kill people along the way doing it. Shoot bears and get like the sharpshooter thing, but like um, I'm not gonna do that. So we need to stay on task with the mission. Ooh, what was that? some more them corpses because we can rack up quite a lot of money doing it and we've got like some more revolver ammo which is good I'm actually going to start using my double barreled shotgun because I feel like I've, I haven't been using it that much hold on Loot these last two. This ain't nice. I know. I got a beat on you, partner. These bullets burn too. You ain't gonna leave here walking, friend. Oh, you ever shoot that with a hard rock stem? There we are, we can shoot the TNT crates and that'll allow us to um, blow them up, which will kill the nearby enemy, of course. And we could just loot this guy as well. Now what are you gonna do? Well, you have to be careful because they can kill you as well. The and they, crap, they could um, blow me up instantly if they shot the TNT barrel. So it's very important to try and move away from it if like if you're close to one and there's going to be an enemy shooting from the opposite side. So there's another one here. Hold on. Yeah, he's behind here. He almost shot that box. But whatever, let's loot him. Close. 
Sometimes it can be quite annoying to reload the anti battle shotgun. There we are. Now we can just loot this guy right here. reloading behind cover but before we get on the mine cart we're gonna um, shoot some of these guys Okay, so we're gonna grab onto the minecart now. And start pushing it through. So we have to slow down and stop if there's enemies. I thought I'd be looking at your corpse being hauled up this lift. Load up and I'll engage the gears. Sakes alive! There she is. What a beautiful weapon. God's own gun. Ain't that the truth? I got us a borrowed flatbed parked down the lot. Meet me at the bottom of the hill! Okay, so we're gonna push the minecart. So we need to push it this way. At the bottom of the hill. So we're just gonna keep pushing it. This is the wrong way to push it, of course. I can use my rev revolver, but I can't use my repeater carbine or anything like that. There we are, so there's more along here. And now we're just going real fast and riding it, of course. Need to shoot that TNT. Now we've got it to the bottom. now and we'll have this executive peacemaker delivered to old west dickens the 
Just make sure it doesn't fall off on the way. Okay guys, so that's all we have for this episode today. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, make sure to please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you all later guys. Bye.